Hi everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. Hello, first of all, happy new year guys. I have not seen you since Christmas day. So I hope you guys all had a wonderful holiday. I hope you had a magical new year. Cheers to 2021. I hope you guys have put some goals in place or if you haven't and your goal is just to wake up every day, that's a great goal. That's a perfect goal. That's one of my goals. Uh, I'm rambling, weird. Let me know in the comments below if you guys have set yourselves any 2021 goals. What did I do? You guys probably want to know like what I got into. Maybe you don't want to know, but I'm going to tell you guys. I pretty much relaxed. I cleaned the house. I organized. We did take down our beautiful Christmas tree that went down January 2nd. And I moved the chair. As you guys can see, it's right here. This is where the tree was. That was the whole plan for the chair. Oh, we're watching a new series. It's called, it's not new actually. New to us, not new to everybody else who's already watched it. There's five seasons. It's on Netflix and it is called Peaky Blinders. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I have literally become obsessed. Larry and I love it. Very violent though. So if you're not into that kind of thing, I wouldn't watch it. I don't know, just family time and relaxing. It was really interesting not being on my phone and like messaging you guys. So I miss you guys. I hope you're all doing really well and it's great to be back. Another update, the P.O. Box. Larry and I did go through everything. We're no longer filming the P.O. Box videos, but we are opening them and then sending a letter your way. So if you sent something and there was an address attached or you left your Instagram handle where I could message you, those letters have been sent out and thank you so much. Yeah, so let's get started with today's vlog. I really don't know what's going on. I just decided, well, today's the day. <laughs> it's Monday after the new year, so I figured I would film. Before we get started, this video is sponsored by Skillshare. If you guys don't know what Skillshare is, it's an amazing site where you can take online courses, which is really, really fun. I have found a few that interested me, and one is iPhone photography, and the teacher for that class is Dale McManus. And the other one is Style Your Space, and Emily Henderson teaches it. You guys know that lately I've been really into styling and trying to organize because I have a lot of mismatched items, which is totally okay. But I want to listen to this class and learn about it. I have already done the iPhone photography class. I highly recommend it. It's super fun. It's easy. If you're interested in self-development they have self-development it's the perfect time of year to do it too as well i know a lot of us are at home so that's another good reason to take these online classes the iphone photography course will teach you how to create beautiful pictures with your iphone or a phone that is similar to an iphone it'll teach you how to put depth into your pictures it also teaches you how to make like everyday simple photos like this chair and this plant look so much better. So there's a bunch of tips that they give you and tips that you can follow to really better your photography. I know Larry loves photography. I love photography. I know a lot of you guys enjoy it too. So Skillshare is just a really awesome way to broaden your horizons, take courses, further our education on so many different topics. The first 1,000 people to use the link in my description will get a free trial of Skillshare Premium Membership. And after that, it's only around $10 a month. So check out the link below. Let me know what you guys are interested in, what you peek at after you look at the site, what you decide to pick if you take a course. I would love to know what interests you guys as well. Skillshare, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. And let's Let's get on with the rest of the vlog. Today's gonna be a very just like a chatty home vlog is what's happening. But so far today, Larry and I went in to get Larry's eyes checked because Larry got contacts, contact lenses, and I am so excited for him. So he did really well. I am tracking, by the way, I am officially tracking my ovulation cycle. So we're currently doing that, which is really, 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 really exciting. Um, I posted over on my Instagram for you guys to let me know what your 2021 goals and so many of you have the same goal as I do with becoming pregnant this 2021. So if you are pregnant or if you're trying, I understand. Well, I don't understand the pregnant part, but congratulations if you're pregnant and if you are trying, never give up, don't give up. And Lord, hello guys, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. You know when you, you're on vacation from work, right? And 
you haven't been there in a while and you like forget how to answer the phone or you forget your combination or you forget your password. I honestly feel like I have forgotten how to film, like forgotten how to vlog. I'm messing up. I am laughing at myself. And you guys might be like, what's wrong with her? And I feel like I'm just, I'm just out of practice. Grab your teas and grab your coffees halfway through this video now. We're just gonna sit and this is gonna be this part of the vlog. This is gonna be my first vlog back and that's okay. You know, we didn't get up to very much, but that's okay. In 2021, my goals besides pregnancy journey are self-development. I want to really focus on my energy. I really noticed on my 11 days break, I really was not on social media at all. I didn't only not upload or post anything. I didn't go in and check anything either. I just didn't look because I know that sometimes social media can affect our mental health and it does. And I'm sure it has affected a lot of you guys as well. So if you go through that too, make sure you're taking a good detox. You just need to take a step back. And that's what I did. And I thought it was really, it's, it's revitalizing. You know what I'm saying? It's very revitalizing. And it just made me do other things like getting a puzzle started or watching a new series with Larry, focusing on house stuff. Oh my gosh, guys, <laughs> let me tell you, when I'm not on social media, you want to know, I keep up with the dishes. There's never a dirty dish in the sink. I'm like a maniac doing the dishes all the time in the laundry and it's a great feeling. It was a great, great feeling. So that was nice. I've also been taking care of my health more. I'm limiting my intake of coffee creamers. A lot of you guys don't add coffee creamer to your coffee if you're overseas. You guys usually use milk. Over here, we have all those foo foo fancy, like, not fancy, but like sugary additives, creamers, and stuff like that. So once you get used to that, plain milk or almond milk, I don't, mm mm. Luna, you wanna say hi? So, anyways, I'm cutting back on that. The girls, okay. Oh, come here. Okay, beans. Luna, say hi. Um, hi, baby. What are you doing? Did you have a good vacation? You want to tell them how your Christmas and New Year was? You want to say hi to all the other kitties and doggies? So the girls both had their vet appointments. 100% good, she's beautiful, everything is great. Look at these babies. You girls are being so good. Can we just take a minute and appreciate this beautiful January calendar? <laughs> oh, we're so, Jesus. Ways up, ah! <laughs> How 2021 is going, I almost said 2020, how 2021 vlogging is going. It's not going well so far. My microphone won't stay up here my camera's about to fall oh man we're off to a good start oh oh okay so we need to fix our little hogwarts calendar because it's an absolute disaster i have not done it since oh wait no let's not put that in i haven't done it since christmas so here we go put it in order all right so it is january what is, what even is today's date Oh, here's my calendar. It's the fourth. All right, so let's put it in. I find these block calendars to be so satisfying. I got one for my dad for Christmas, actually. My grandpa loves it. I think he changes it every morning. There we go. We're set. Hi, babe. Hi. What have I been up to? <laughs> yeah, what you been up to? How's life? Goals for 2021? What's new? You know, all that fun jazz. Well, one at a time. I finally have joined the AirPod family. Yes, you have. I have. It's for my first time using them. My brother called me every day. He's like, have you used them? Yeah, have you used them? I'm like, I have a reason to use them because I'm not getting on any platform where I need to use headphones. Today was the first day because I'm editing that I could use them and I love it. No phone, no light, no motor cars. Yeah. Where's that from? I don't know. I just came running out of the office excited. No. I don't know. The other exciting thing about that is now that she has those, she's going to give me the ones that go into the phone that have oh, the yeah. wire. Yeah, you can have my wires. Because I've never had them. Yeah. Oh, my God. I just noticed your contact lenses, though. How does it feel your first day with them? I'm still getting used to them. Do they bother you at all? Well, my eyes are goofy because I need some correction for close up and then I need some for far away. So one eye is for close, one eye is for far away, and you have to kind of get used to it. That would be bizarre. See, mine yeah. are both the same, so I don't have that issue. Yeah. So otherwise, or you could get 
bifocal contact lenses. I didn't know such a thing existed. But you have to be very careful with how you put them in. Hey. Be nice. Not much has changed. They are doing better, though. Much really better. they are. They're, yeah. they're sleeping in the same bed with us. Everything is great. They have a little hiccups in the middle of the night, but overall, it's better. Luna was given Lexi little licks on the, on the top of the head this morning. No noise, no fights, no nothing. But I guess it's the okay. bifocal contact lenses are very expensive. Look how blue your eyes look though. Like we can see and appreciate his eyes now so much more. Well, it's because I have contacts and that's why Titties. you can see him better. Yeah, just we have a visitor. Yes. She's watching, she's prowling. She's right behind you, but up a, up a little bit. Yeah, had an excellent Christmas, one of my best. And New Year's was fun. Our New Year's Eve was so chilled. We we did it so differently this year. We just sat on the couch and watched movies until like 14 minutes until midnight. And then we turned on the news and like counted down and did the ball drop with the world for 14 minutes and then cut and went right back to just like watching movies. It was super low key. Yeah, we went outside for a few minutes and listened to everybody blowing things up and lots of fireworks. Yeah, that was kind of Kind of it was fun. You don't really go out and party and do the whole New Year's Eve thing anymore anyways. Like the last several years, we've just kind of hung out with family, which is nice. I enjoy it. I've had my years of partying on New Year's Eve with friends. Oh, yeah. It's a fun time, but I don't miss waking up sick the next day. <laughs> did you guys wake up <laughs> sick the next day or did you have a productive New Year's Day? Do you have any 2021 goals? Ooh, no. 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 Same... <laughs> Same thing as always, just try and be better and try and learn something new every day. That's cute. I like that. But no resolutions. I don't I don't do resolutions. No, he doesn't. I resolve not to do resolutions. We got all the tree down and we got a spot for the chair. All the Christmas decorations are, are put away. It took me a minute to really let go of Christmas. Took you a minute? It took me a while. It took her a week. I was sad. I, I was like... I was sad when Christmas ended. I was like, I can't believe it happened. I can't believe it's over. January I, 2nd, what are we gonna watch? Let's watch Elf. I didn't, I was like, we have to watch Christmas movies. When I had a full day after Christmas where I did nothing but watch Christmas movies. Cause you get so wrapped up in like filming and vlogging and editing that you're like, it's like a constant go. And I just wanted to sit with my blanket on the couch with the kitties and Larry and watch Christmas movies. And that's that was another thing that we did. And we did. Yeah, it was really nice. It was peaceful. You've been very into your audiobooks. Oh, yeah! I've been listening to my Harry Potter books, which is nice. I have not read in a while. I need to get caught up. Yeah, you gotta get back to your reading. Mm -hmm. Luna's dragging her butt on the carpet. Nothing new there. State Route 2. <laughs> Hershey Highway coming through. That's a weird noise. Did my hair a little differently today? Not mine. I just didn't do anything to it. I just kind of twirled it. No, mine's back. different. I think there's some of it missing. Are there, you know what? You're funny. It is a miracle if you guys are still watching this video. I'm just saying. Because it's just been me talking and now Larry and I sitting on the floor and talking. And I just don't. I don't know. I, I feel like I'm out of practice. I feel like I completely have forgotten how to vlog. I just, I, I don't even, I don't know what to do with myself. Well, but. I'm, I'm glad that it's, it's back to the way it was. I missed you guys. Yeah, we did. Mm -hmm. It was weird. It was weird not being in touch with you guys. So I'm glad we're back. I'll have to figure out how to do this again because apparently it's gone. <laughs> you can do it. And cheers to 2021. Cheers to a very exciting new year. I told them that we are up to the point of tracking ovulation. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. I'm going to film a whole video on that, I think. Like the ovulating journey and when I start ovulating. So stay tuned. That will be coming eventually. I just don't know when. It just depends on how things go. But just to keep you like in the time loop and let you guys actually know what's going on in our lives, I am testing for ovulation. So I'm hoping that we'll be going this week. Fingers crossed, could be days away. To the clinic. Yes. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna let you guys go. I hope you enjoyed this <laughs> sit down chattiness at home. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave us a comment down below. Wrap up, sum up your 2020 for me in the comments down below. Let me know what your goals for 2021 are. And let me know if you guys decide to take a Skillshare course. I would love to know what you guys decide to take. Larry's gonna take some too, I think, with me. I think me. so, absolutely. They have photography ones. I saw that. Yeah, so. Yes. 
What present did you get for Christmas that made you the happiest? Oh, that's cute. What was yours? Put you right on the spot. Yes, you did. I like the amount of thought and the creativity and, and things yeah. that are put into different things. So it... Uh, and spending the day with the family was fun. My favorite moment was being able to sit on the couch with my entire family and Larry on Christmas Day and just watch everybody and just be in the moment. I think that that's such a thing nowadays. Like a lot of times you're living life through a lens or you're living life through a phone and you're not in the moment, just you, yourself, and people. You're, there's distractions constantly. Even if you don't film or vlog, there's your phone, it's in your hand, you're texting people while having a conversation. Give that person in your life that's actually there, like that one-on-one. -on -one. And that's what we did. We did do that. So, anyways, we're gonna end this here. I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. See you again very soon. Don't know when, but I'll see you soon. <laughs> Let's do Monday, Wednesday, Saturdays. Wednesday? What day is it? What day is Wednesday? <laughs> what day is the Monday? <laughs> All right, see you guys Monday, Wednesday, and Saturdays. Oh, the times. The times. Do I want to keep it at four or do it at nine? See you guys soon. Bye. Bye.